Oh my god, are you okay? I came as fast as I could. I didn't expect things to be this way and... Oh, I'm just glad you're okay. That would have been terrible. Dang, I got so nervous that I, I almost lost it. I thought that the incident that happened, that you were caught up in it, that'd be terrible. Oh my goodness. I'm a little shaken up. I'll be just fine. <laughs> let's, let's get you away from here. I'll handle cleaning this up later. Um, do you know what happened though? I saw it on the news and I, I thought the worst. I'll be honest with you. I don't usually think the worst in things, but thinking that it could happen so close to home and with you, I, I got a little shaky, as you can see. Not very manly of me, I know, but, uh, <laughs> oh, I just need a moment to catch my breath. I'll be just fine. Uh, oh, my goodness. Talk about getting a scare. No, we gotta find out if there's anything we can salvage. I'm so sorry. You must have lost so much in your apartment. It's no good, is it? I'm just trying my best here. Should we go look through everything? Do they know if it's safe? Hey, officer, do you know what happened around here? Hey, wait a second. Let me look at those pictures. What does this mean? Why are there names on here? What are those names? Hey, honey. Do you know what those names mean? That, that are on the broken wall. And it looks like there's numbers too. I don't trust this. I don't trust this at all. I'm... I'm gonna... I'm gonna make sure they don't do anything crazy. Those are... Those are your family members' names? They know us better than we thought. I'm... Really sorry that you've had to deal with this. Um... I promise. I'll protect you. I'll get these guys. Nobody can do this to you. I won't let them. Uh, yeah. Getting too angry won't solve anything. I'm really sorry that you had to see a side of me like that. It's not something I'm used to and sometimes I do struggle with anger. It's Walling up inside and thinking that somebody's targeting you, that's practically my worst nightmare. So it's, uh, it's a little scary. You know how it is. <laughs> I'll just, uh, keep myself busy, okay? And get your family to a safe place, okay? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go investigate. I want to get to the bottom of this. No, I wouldn't... <sighs> Fine. You're right. I'm pissed off. They... picked a fight with us. They picked a fight with you. I... I can't... I don't know what to do in this situation. Other than... be a hero and take down the villain. <sighs> they don't usually do this kind of at-home tactic. They're not usually this good. Think of how many things they had to know. And yeah, it's frightening. Because I love you so much. Of course, you already knew that. Officer, what's that supposed to mean? No, what you just said. Why did you just say that? You wasn't Come on, spit it out. 
I, I gotta know. It's... It's really important and stuff. Come on. Oh, dang it. You don't know? This is getting really crazy. And I'm sorry. I... I guess you want to go with me, eh? I guess if they made a mistake on you, they'll... Let's go together and make sure your parents are okay. And your family. I don't like this. I definitely heard someone say something and I didn't like it at all. Five fingers. But why? I, I don't understand. It doesn't make any sense to me and I, I don't have anything to go off of. Hey, you think all this could just be some kind of... some kind of cruel prank or something? I'm hoping this isn't as elaborate as... as it could be. As I think it is. I... I'm just... glad you're okay. Let's be thankful for what it is. It shouldn't be long now. We'll rendezvous with your parents on the way to the headquarters. Then we'll get a move on. It'll be nice to see them, won't it? I'm thinking of doing the same with my parents soon. Though, for now, I think it's a closed case. According to what I know of the police reports and the information that was sent to me, they think they have a lead. I'm gonna check it out after we make sure your parents are okay. That's probably the best way to do it. The quicker we shut down this guy, the faster everyone can be safe again. Look, I'm gonna try my hardest, but I need to know you're with me. I, I'm gonna go chase that lead. Of course, after we check with your parents and stuff, it's all about making sure everyone's okay first. Don't let this get you down. I may be a little nervous, but I'm not done yet. All right, we're here. Looks like everything's fine. The police even beat us here and a few heroes. See? Today won't be so bad after all. I mean, it sucks to lose all that stuff, but at least I didn't lose you. That's what's really important. And, well, whatever the meaning of those words, I, I'm sure the lead will get something. Let's drive them back to the headquarters. All right. Looks like they'll be staying here for now. Um, do take care. Make sure to let me know if there's any problems. They're not so bad at the headquarters, really. They can be a little strict, so just bear with them for your time here. As for me, well, I'm gonna take this one right here and we're gonna go investigate. We're heroes at the end of the day and we just gotta make sure. We gotta see if we can put an end to this before anyone else has to lose anything. So let's head over to headquarters. They said that they got new information, so... Well, are you sure you want to go with me? It's not easy. And it might put you in danger. But if you're sure, then come on. We'll get there in style. <laughs> what, surprised I have a motorcycle? You shouldn't be. I'm kind of good at this. I have a lot of things that you would probably not expect. Hopefully in a good way. <laughs> Guess we'll see. Let's get going and catch this jerk. Woohoo! Here we go. How you like the wind blowing through your hair? I always thought it was pretty fun riding a motorcycle like this. Here's hoping you like it too. <laughs> Here we are. That wasn't so bad, now was it? We're just getting started, right? And besides, 
You know you love me. I guess that was out of the blue, but all these crazy things going on just made me want to say it. Just in case something happens. I don't think it will, but I need you to know that I actually care about you a whole lot. So much that I, if we survive all this, I want you to marry me. Yeah, that's right. We'll make a bet on it. Just you wait. I'll make sure you don't regret it. You're my baby after all. And I feel really strongly about you. And while I'm angry at that person for trying to hurt you, I can't keep angry when you're right next to me. Let's go to HQ. Let's see what they say. Hey! If it isn't old Dry Eye. What's that supposed to mean? I barely even... Never mind. So I see you're here with your... Partner. Am I to assume that you're both going on this mission? No, wait. It's not even an official mission, is it? So you're chasing after ghosts right now, are you, Kurishima? Uh, 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 it's not chasing after ghosts if you have a lead. I heard you guys got one. So why don't you spill the beans, old man? Hey, who are you calling an old man? I'm barely even older than you, kid. Don't you just know I'm a prodigy? That's why I was teaching at such a youthful age. Just don't ask what my age is. And I'll give you the information. Maybe just this once. You seem like you got a pretty good head on your shoulders, but don't get ahead of yourself. So it looks like... We're dealing with something big here. It looks like there's been small explosives that have gone off at different parts of town. Each one having some cryptic message on it. We've managed to piece them together. One of them says, look at the sky. Another saying some trivial line about, you should look behind you. No matter what they said, that's not what's important. It's what the letters that they started with were. It's a cipher of some sort. And we managed to decipher a location. We think it's a trap, so we sent a bunch of heroes there, only to find nothing. There wasn't even a clue. No explosion, no nothing. So they were kind of peeved at that. And, well, let's just say we thought it was a dead end at first. But in the end, we just figured out we got it wrong. That was sort of a dummy location. They... They want you to go here. It's... Probably not smart to go alone, but we already have sources that There's some pretty big criminal activity going on here So what we're thinking is this is just to get our attention They want us to face off against these guys. It's probably somebody pulling the strings That's what I think anyways Yeah, yeah, it's just a theory. It's not really information this isn't my first rodeo, kid. So, take it or leave it. Th thanks. I appreciate anything I can get. So it looks like this location. It's in a really populated area. Don't tell me. That's why you have to send in just me. Someone small that's not gonna raise a ruckus. Otherwise they might involve all those innocent people. Damn. They really pulled the wool over our eyes. Guess we have to do something about it, but... Well, we'll see when we get there. We're gonna go in disguise. Should be pretty fun. All things considered. I like playing dress up. Don't you? W wait, I don't mean it like that. C come on. I'm manly and cool. And a badass, so... Yeah, you get the point. Let's go. I always wanted to go to this shopping district. It has some good food. And I kind of always wanted to take you there. Um, so... It depends. Under these circumstances, we have to act differently. 
I'm gonna try and keep a low profile. Don't get too close. Otherwise, they'll know we're together. So from here on out, make sure you're a few steps away. Don't worry. If anything happens, you have my word as your man that I'll protect you. They can't stop me. Come on. You already know it. <laughs> so, um, let's do this. Let's find these jerks. Hmm. Where could they be? If what I'm thinking is right, they're gonna be over here. Right in the thick of everything. I guess we look for a suspicious person. Hmm. No one's really standing out. Wait a second. There's someone on top of the building. It looked like they were moving pretty quick. And they look out of place. Let's go investigate. Stop right there, criminal! Uh, hello? Why isn't there anyone up here? Dang it. Were we too late? This is difficult. Be careful, okay? I don't want them to separate us. But I guess our cover's blown. Hold on. Over there! There's something on the ground. What could this mean? I can't say I've ever seen anything like this before. Dang it. What does it mean? It's like a coin, but there's a symbol on it. I don't know what it means personally. I don't think we have time to find out. Hey, wait. Look over there. There they are on that rooftop. I'm thinking maybe their quirk lets them move fast or get around easy. Fortunately, we don't seem to have anything like that. So we're gonna have to go about this the old fashioned way. Come with me. I'll make sure they don't hurt you. Don't gotta worry about a thing when I'm around. <laughs> if I'm good at anything, it's shielding people and making sure those I love. Don't get hurt. Nah, nah, I don't even feel it. Even a big explosion, it's nothing compared to... Hold on. Something's not right, there's two of them. Why does it look like they're... They're fighting? I'm kind of confused. What's going on? Anyways, we don't have time, let's go. Nice masks! Is it Halloween already? Too bad I didn't bring mine. Guess I'll just have to show you the point! Here I go! With the Kirishima Special! Launching myself with explosives! Never nail the landing! It's fine! Now... Am I telling me what's going on here? I'm about to beat both of you up. Wait. They both ran different ways. Crud. We gotta chase one. Get back here! Dang it! Why do they look identical? They're dang fast, too. Uh... No, we can't have you getting separated. It's too dangerous, but... Dang it. I guess we don't have any other choice, do we? Huh. You better not get hurt. You promise? All right. I'll chase this one. You chase that one. Precious little thing. Why did you decide to chase me? 
Oh, must right up there. I just saw him. No, I'm, I'm just fine, honey. You don't need to worry. Uh, just a little scratch. Besides, I'm the most durable hero there is. You can't think something like this is gonna get me down. It's barely anything. Trust me. Yeah, I promise. All right, let's go. Hey, you bastard! What are you even doing here? Just standing around? You want me to catch up to you? And what's with that cheap shot you did earlier? You can't be serious. Not gonna say anything? Is that really what it comes down to? What do you mean? This guy's... dangerous. I do get that feeling. Dang. And I'm not sure. But I'm gonna find out. I hope you got a good quirk, buddy. Cause you're gonna need it to take me down. You don't get it, do you? They're playing you like a fool. Trying to get us to... I don't want to hear it. That last attack, if I was a second too late, that could have killed me. I already know what type of person you are, damn villain. Stop this. You're wasting your time. Your efforts. Do you not understand what happened here? You must have seen it. There's two of us, you idiot. Two of us. Don't you get it, Hero? This is all a distraction. To waste both of our time. Open your eyes and realize you've been played, Hero. We both have. See those pretty little explosions? I'd never do something so cruel. And if it takes you beating the shit out of me... To prove that... Do your worst. I won't lose to you. Uh, I've had worse beatings than this. By my... Damn old man. So you're just a joke, aren't you? You're no hero. Uh, shut up. What do you know? You... You're... You're the hero who disappeared. 
Why are you here? Why are you in front of him? Stop trying to defend him, he's a villain. He tried to kill me. What do you mean? I don't understand. None of this makes any sense. Then who is... Who is the person behind the mask? I thought... That... You would be the other one. There's someone else? You've got some explaining to do. Nobody's heard from you in a long time. And... Did the villains get to you? How do I know I can trust you? Alright, you two are coming with us. Dang it. I didn't think they'd be able to do something like that. Are you okay, my dear? <laughs> that was a little crazy, wasn't it? Don't worry. When I said it was a scratch, I mean it. I'm just fine. No! The explosions! It's... It's terrible. Can you hear them? I just... I didn't make it. I failed as a hero. Let's see if we can save some people. There's no time for me to feel sorry for myself. Let's go. Everyone this way. Get out of the center. Get out of the square. I don't know who would do something like this. Or who could get away with all this. But they'll pay. All these people. I've never had to witness something like this. But I feel like I've... If I'd been a little quicker, I... I know. I know. It's no use. Blaming for things. Hindsight's 2020, after all. So we gotta make sure we put on a smile so people don't get worried. I'm gonna try my best, okay? Let's get these people out of here. I think we managed to avoid a lot of people getting hurt. I couldn't have done it without you today. And while well, I'm a little shook up, I guess laughing's kind of my way. My way of coping with it all, so... I hope you don't think I'm making some kind of joke of this. I wouldn't dream of it, and... Well, it's... It's all so stressful, and... I don't know how to react. Even just thinking about it. When I really face the facts that so many people... They lost their lives today. I... I don't know what to say. It's terrible, isn't it? This is why we heroes exist. So I wasn't someone there to stop it. I need some time for a bit, okay? And... Wait a second. What happened? Your arm. Show it to me. Come on. You know I can take the truth. You know. You're pretty wounded. Let's get you back. Yeah, I'm gonna carry you, okay? It's the least I could do. And besides, I... I gotta smile so I... Don't start crying. That wouldn't be very manly of me. <laughs> Let's go to headquarters. It's sure to be safe there. and We can see our family. It'll be nice, right? I'm looking forward to the food. I don't know about you. Did you know headquarters? Has a bunch of underground houses. I've always wanted to live in one of them. Just because they're so high tech. And... <laughs> Um, we'll get to live in one temporarily until we get all this stuff sorted out. 
No, don't worry about that. I'm sure it's just... Just fireworks going off in the distance. I'm sure some hero is saving the day. So we... We just gotta believe in them, right? I believe in you. And you never let me down, so... Let's just get home, okay? <laughs> We're here, I guess. So, um... Did you manage to say hi to your folks for me? I, uh... Told mine about everything, and... Well... It was a rough day, to be honest with you. But as a hero, it's... You kind of have to have to deal with these and as your man and as the manliest of men that exist I can't go showing you weakness now I gotta show you that we're gonna get through this no matter what they say we're heroes at the end of the day proud graduates of UA and pro heroes so so let's Let's have a good time, okay? No, I'm not crying, just got something in my eye, okay? It's, it's tough with all this stuff that went down and I'm just happy to be with you. And they say when you face crisis, it humbles you to what you have and makes you appreciate life in a new way. I appreciate you. You're my sunshine, and you're amazing. Okay? There, I said it. Besides, I, um, I, uh, got to tend to that wound for you. I almost forgot about it, and you probably did too, didn't you? <laughs> Isn't it kind of funny how the most important things sometimes escape us? I'm just glad my most important thing didn't leave me. Because you're right in front of me. Thank you, baby. I just, I just love you so much. You know, there's a lot of words that people say and I just, I can't get enough of saying the simple ones when I'm with you, because it doesn't matter what happened in the day. One look at you, and I feel like a million bucks. And it's just, the feeling never stops, and I, I really love you. You know, with all that heavy stuff that happened today, I just, it all melts away. And look, I'll even show you. Remember that injury I got earlier? It's almost all gone. And that's all your magical healing power. You're basically like Recovery Girl 2.0, at least to me. <laughs> I hope you don't mind, but I, I wanted to tend to your wounds properly and give you the same treatment. All right, Dr. Kirishima is on duty. So that wasn't too cheesy, was it? Here's hoping, but um, yeah, that looks like a doozy, but we're gonna patch you right up, okay? Just relax, <laughs> we're just getting started. Besides you, you're so beautiful and cool and, well, I made up that word for you the other day. Okay, that was a while back, but it feels like the other day and I still think it fits you. <laughs> Beauty cool. Maybe, yeah, you're probably right. I said it by accident, but that doesn't change the fact that it's a really cool word in my book, because it has to do with you. That's all it takes to make something cool. Well, most of the time. If I'm feeling a little bit more Difficult, then it has to be something more like beauty cool rific. Okay, that was that was probably just bad, but 
I tried. So... I don't even know what to say there. <laughs> so... Let's forget about what happened today. The heroes won overall. And we're not going to let those villains walk all over us. Even if there's deeper meanings or something we're missing, we can worry about that tomorrow. For now, we got to get you patched up like this and that. And ooh la la. That body of yours makes me really excited. Well, I, I don't mean in exactly in the, well, I'm not going to lie. It's in every way. <laughs> You're just the best, and I, I want more of you. Maybe I say that too much. I hope I don't get too repetitive. You know, sometimes I just let my brain go, and I say whatever comes to mind. I don't really hold back when it comes to you. You're the really the only person that I can do that. I just don't stop talking because I feel like if I do, you're going to get bored of me. And that's the last thing I want, especially in all this craziness. I hope you didn't lose too much in the explosion. They said it wasn't a real bad one, but the house kind of collapsed. So I'd imagine most of your precious things are still intact. We'll get these guys. Don't worry, you have my word. I'll give them a bite. I guess that doesn't really sound like I'm going to take them down. Sounds like I'm just going to nibble on their arm or something. I, I don't mean it like that. I'd never nibble on an arm of any villain. I don't like those guys. And, well, with that hero today, well, former hero, I didn't mention it for a reason. I'm going to give them the benefit of the doubt that they're trying to do something good, too. I mean, that villain didn't even try and fight back. He lectured me through the punches. Who lectures someone through punches? That's... that's unheard of. And, well, I just... I want things to be okay. So I'm going to be a hero at the end of the day. But the one who matters the most to me, who I want to be a hero more than anyone else, do you care to take a guess of who it is? Well, you bet. It's you. Well, I, I, I didn't really need to say that. You probably already knew. Knowing you. You're always one step ahead of me. And even more than that, you're one step ahead of those bad guys. Did you learn anything? I'd imagine you did. You chased after that other one and came back so quick. You must have... Well, I'll just assume... Huh? Hmm. So, they said some weird things. Eh, don't let it get to you. Villains always do that, and I don't really get it. They always like to say these egotistical things, like they're just the kings of the world, and... Frankly... I like to knock them down a notch. Show them that we're all just people at the end of the day. And that I'm the coolest hero there is. You gotta be manly when you take them down. Remember, you've probably met my buddy Tetsu 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 Tetsu. He's... He's a pretty good guy. I think he's very honorable. One of the few heroes that understands the manliness code. Oh, did I never tell you about it before? The manliness code is really, really, really important. Because if you lose the manliness code, you are not manly anymore. In fact, you're probably a sissy. And I don't really have any problems with that, but I want to be manly myself. Huh. And I guess I came out wrong. Because while I want to be manly, I, I don't want to put down people who aren't. And I mean... Uh... Sometimes this is the consequence of talking before I think. I'll say something that I don't really mean, and, uh... Well, you know what? I'm not gonna sweat it. We've had enough stress today. It's important that at the end of the day, you always sit down, have a nice meal, get patched up, so tomorrow's even better. I know this will all work out. Somehow. 
We'll make sure it... That it... Doesn't turn bad. I'll stay strong and you do too. I'm your strength after all. Aren't I? <laughs> You're really something else. Going with that mission today? I'm not the best at undercover. But I felt... I had to. I had to at least try. If I didn't, I couldn't really call myself your man. Let somebody do this to my... my most precious person. That's... that's unacceptable. And I'll get them back for it. Even if that one guy was innocent, then that means there's just one other pulling the strings and they're even worse. We're gonna make sure we find them. When we do, they're going down. You have my word. And it's really nice to, well, just sit here with you. And look at that. I was talking your head off so much, you probably didn't even notice that I patched you up already. Though I may have removed too much clothing. Here, let's get that back on you. <laughs> I guess you're a little bit more aware than I am, hey? D d that's fine. I wouldn't be a man if I wasn't ready for situations like this, too. Um, kind of ready. So, well, I'm gonna kiss you. And I'm gonna do it without regret. Like I always do. Deal? As if you had a choice. <laughs> I'm kidding with you. You always have the choice. I wouldn't be manly if I took that away from you. Unless, of course, I took it away willingly. <laughs> Come here, you. <sighs> <laughs> Baby, here's something else. I mean. We've barely done anything yet, and I'm already, well, raring to go. <laughs> it's a little embarrassing, but I, I'm not going to beat around the bush either. That would be kind of pathetic, wouldn't it? That's just not the type of man I am. If there's a wall, I'll break right through it. So, if you'll pardon me... <laughs> Why are you freaking out? I just removed a bit of clothing from you. We gotta make sure those bandages are on tight. Here, let's check. <sighs> Looks good. But Dr. Kirishima has to make sure of everything. We couldn't miss a wound and leave it to get infected, could we? Oh no. Looks like you're bruised here. Never fear. I'll take care of you. <clears throat> ah. Mm. Ah. Your body's looking pretty good. Not that it ever didn't. Underestimating me again, are you? 
Don't go and do something silly like that. I might just surprise you. <laughs> What's wrong? My teeth too sharp for you? I like growling in your ear. And what's wrong? Getting a little too manly for you? I'll make sure it's worth your time. <laughs> what if we bite down here? Don't mind me. <laughs> Looks to me like you see a shark. Well, it's a good thing that I don't eat people. Mm. Mm. Well, I might have a little bit of a taste for cuties. Better not make a sound. Or I might Go into a feeding frenzy. Uh-oh. Instincts might be kicking in. It might be too late for you, patient. You're shark food. Mm. Mm. <laughs> ah, seems like you're practically begging for this shark's bite. Maybe I should nibble just a bit. I'm only kidding with you. Or am I? Can't escape that easy. Mm. Mm. Squirm all you like. The sharks will chase you for miles. Mm. Now I've got you by the weak spot. Mm. Mm. Got this shark all riled up. Now, let's see. I wouldn't want you to open up those new wounds, so I guess we'll have to stop there, won't we? Hey, why are you tugging on my arm like that? Oh, I see. I guess you're a bit naughty, aren't you? It's okay. Are you saying it's okay if I 
Give you a little bite here and there. I guess if I'm a doctor too, it's okay, isn't it? Mm. Don't mind if I do. Now, you've got me all excited, so why don't we have you show me more? I gotta make sure there's no more wounds on your body. So, pardon me. <laughs> I always like seeing you like this. Irresistible, I tell you. Perfection. Oh. Oh no. Looks like there's still an open wound. Right here. I guess we'll have to plug it a bit. Yeah, I don't care if it was cheesy. You're all mine. Oh, baby. You're really too good for me. So I gotta give it to you like a man and make sure you feel as loved as you make me feel. Yeah, just like that. Here comes another shark bite. You like that, baby? There's more where that came from. I'll show you what a real man can do to that body of yours. I never thought this operation would be so difficult, patient. Looks like we'll have to use drastic measures. Don't fear. Picking you up is part of the procedure. Don't get embarrassed now. You look so sexy. you like this so you can't move. Having your legs up like this makes me feel like I'm completely in control and really manly. 
I think they call this... The... It has something to do with someone named Nelson. I don't really know the name. <laughs> so... It gives me a nice... view in that mirror. I like claiming you as my own and... Frankly, all my nervousness melts away when I get to see you enjoying yourself. So maybe some call it lewd, but I think it can be innocent. It can be nice. If it's true love, there's nothing to be ashamed of. And you love me, don't you? I love you so, so much that it, it hurts. And, oh, I guess having a conversation while, um... That's still in there. Um, should I put you down? I guess this is a little, well, maybe I got carried away. So when you move like that, it kind of makes me want to go again. So don't squirm too much. Uh, uh, um, so, well, now that you're there, I'm... Whoops. <laughs> you're not upset at me or anything, are you? Oh, that's good. I thought maybe I got carried away and uh, I took the manliness thing maybe a little bit too far. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm confident about it. But I don't want you to get the wrong idea. That I don't have sense of who I am and what you mean to me. If anything, today has been sobering. I'm gonna make sure future is a bright place. And that no matter how much time passes, no matter how much we face, I'll always be your man. And I'll make sure that you can trust that. And that you can believe in me when I say it. I'll get even stronger. I've been learning to do something really cool with my quirk lately. Um, no, it's a little embarrassing. Maybe I'll get to show you next time. Well, the next mission, and... What, what were you thinking? Oh, no. Don't tell me. You were thinking I meant that. During that. I... I mean, I could try next time if it's, uh... One of your things, I... I, I guess. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. That's fine. Well, I don't have a problem with it if you don't. And besides, like... Life is... Life is too dang short. I'm always told this by my parents, and... I want to live every day like it's my last. I don't think I'll be dying anytime soon. Not planning on it. But just in case I do... I want to make sure you have... So many good memories of me. <laughs> Besides, I'll never let something happen to you. So I, I can't exactly go about dying. You know how it is. So, is there anything you wanted to tell me? I just wanted to let you say whatever it is that comes to your heart. If you're stressed, it's okay. I'll always have a shoulder to cry on and a big hug waiting for you. And putting that aside, I also have more than enough cheesy jokes and uh, silly things to tell you, so I'm pretty sure we'll never run out of things to do. What about you? Are you gonna give me shoulders to cry on too? <laughs> As if. I don't think I'll need it, but I do appreciate the sentiment, at least. You're just too amazing. You treat me too good. And it makes me want to give you so much love and attention and happiness. And I'll just be sure. And I'm careful from now on, too. Don't you worry. I'm not some kind of weakling either. You can trust me when I say I'm gonna... I'm gonna make this world 
better place, and I'm not gonna risk myself. Too many heroes go gung-ho into things and get themselves hurt or worse. And after today, I'm gonna really think about it. Think about everything I do and make sure it's all planned and that I have backup plans and I, I guess what I'm saying is I don't want our life together to be one of stress and problems. I don't want you to be depressed and sad because I hurt myself or because something went wrong in life. So when you think about things and you feel sad, look into my eyes, look into my smile. I'll warm you up. Even when you're so cold, you feel like you're gonna die. I'll bring you back, no matter how many times. You can believe in me and I'll believe in you too. Don't go giving up, no matter what it takes. I will forever make sure there are good feelings and good things in this world. I love you. I super love you. If there was a love more than super love, I bet it'd be Omega love and I'd love you that too. And um, call me whatever you like. But if you wanna call me Shark Boy, that's just fine. If it puts a smile on your face, count me in. Unless you want me to wear a dress or something unmanly. I mean, I guess I'm manly enough that I could. It's not really my thing, but I guess I'd consider it for you. Why do you got that look in your eyes? Don't tell me you're gonna... Oh man, I can't trust you yet, can I? Uh, you got a scary look, like a predator. I'm no one's prey. D -d Just you wait. <laughs> What's the situation? You'd never guess that earlier we were in a situation of life and death. I guess that's the beauty of it. I can't stay that way around you. You're the best partner and the best love ever. And, well, I promised myself if we survive this, I'd ask you something really important. Well, I don't really know what to say. I thought I'd ask, want to be more than just dating? <laughs> I have a lot of ideas and uh, it doesn't have to be the traditional stuff, but I thought maybe together we could be something even more. More amazing than before. When two halves are whole, it means the world is a better place. Or so someone told me once. It's okay. I figure you have time for this and I have time to figure out what I mean by it. You're like family to me already. And I'll make sure that I protect you like I protect my family. No more tears, okay? No more sad times. We'll make sure that everything is beautiful and that this world isn't a sad place to live in. Not for you or anyone. That's what I believe. I know we can do it. So stay strong. I'll always be there to cheer you on, cheer you up, and make sure this world bends to our will. I guess that makes me sound like a villain, but y you get the point. I'm like a mountain. You can always depend on me to weather through things. Kirishima, the new mountain. <laughs> Was that cheesy? I hope not. By the way, I think Shark Man suits me better. So, it's your choice. <laughs> so, um, wanna go get something to eat? I guess you gotta take a shower after that. I'll join you. And we can see about getting some of that top grade grub. That's what I'm talking about. The easiest way to a man's heart is through his stomach. It's really true. And I love your cooking. 
Keep up the good work, honey.